We had an accident at a festival with uh, one of our instruments. We will record the first new Rapal show. While I'm doing that, I also will re repair this instrument because something went wrong. I shot some video at a festival in Belgium called Na Verbolk. So we are at a, I hope I pronounce it right, Na Verbolk yes. Festival. Yes. So what does it mean? So it's like um, old Celtish for the fat man. The fat man. Yeah. So um, why the name? Because the or original organizers of the festival, the founders, they were all like fat men. So that's the reason they took the name. This is a very old festival. It, it's already 24 years. Yes, this is the 24th edition. Okay. Yeah. And who, who's the organizer of the festival? Um, I'm one of the organizers, so yeah. we're like eight people. Yeah. Um, yeah. But you're not fat. I'm not fat, but <laughs> I'm not one of the original founders. Ah. So, so the one you spoke before, the fat guy, he was oh, one okay. of the original. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. I know this, this festival, yeah. since Rapali exists, I know that we tried to reach you and we, yeah. we wanted to perform here yeah. like uh, for many years. Yes. And. Um, that we are chasing each other. Ah, thank you for the coffee, David. Hello. Thank you. Hey. Thank you, sir. <laughs> thank you very much. But I think if we mean chasing, it's like considering a rapalje, but then every year we had something else popping in, yeah. in the same genre, or we had different different um, artists that didn't really fit with you. Yeah, but I know. Yeah. We were considering you at least for 15 years already. Yeah, for sure. or we were booked, or uh, yeah, maybe. many yeah. things happened. Yeah, 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 but now finally you are here. So. Yeah, and uh, like I see around here, there is so many... The first, your first festival. How was your first festival? Do you, do you remember the first festival? Yeah, it was it was very very small. Yeah, okay. it was like one one concert, like just a concert evening in a very small hall. So okay. only like a few people were there. Yeah. And and how big is it now? Like last year? In terms of visitors? Yeah. Uh, more than 10k. So more than 10,000 visitors. More than 10,000. And yeah. the first one? Uh, 50. To okay. 100. Yeah. Great. So enjoy your coffee. Yeah. Thank you very much. We're going to take a look around yeah. and enjoy the festival. Yeah. And uh, thank you for having us here. No problem. Very welcome. Your okay. show will be fantastic. So I've got one question. Do you have a t-shirt for me from, from the festival? Okay. I'll try to wear it. Okay, thank yeah. you. Okay. Yeah. yeah. This is what I want to do every week. Record it live and then edit it to a uh, new video on YouTube. I got a new, uh, new setup. Do you like the lights? It looks a little bit like the inside of a spaceship. These are the things you normally won't see when, um, when I'm sitting here. 
Christina Koenig uh, asked me in German again, um, what kind of accident did happen? At this festival in Belgium, I broke my instrument. Feli Groshans writes me, the halbe verbal culpa der Rituki scheint up to sein. Yes, this is, uh, this is not good. So I got some glue, I got my broken instrument, I got some, some clamps. Okay, this fits, this is good. And we also made another video with William together at his home where we are repairing an instrument as well. And what happened here, I can explain to you. I was tuning the instrument, we had to go on stage, and right like two minutes before we went on stage, I put my instrument on the wrong place and it felt right on on the guitar head and it broke like like this and again something ran, went wrong with the instrument damn wasn't me this time wasn't me this is not good i dropped it on the floor i'm sorry so i will put some glue on and in the meantime you can ask me questions Birgit Rosendahl writes important to have a good work-life balance yes and that's what i want to talk about for me time is the most important and most valuable thing I have. I've, I guess uh, many other people also have um, the same feeling. And to manage time, I have to do combinations. That's the reason that I'm now recording the Rapal show, doing the live stream, and at the same time, repairing our Hituki. There are several ways you can, um, you can talk with me or um, have a conversation with me. When I see your comment, I can respond to it. I will respond to every comment you make and uh, give you an answer to your question or uh, whatever re reaction I can give. We have a Patreon account. Uh, if you're a patron, uh, of course, I will uh, always answer your questions when you write me. And uh, the only personal way to really reach me is to subscribe to our um, mailing list. You get videos where we show our home and we show our music and we tell about our music. I will respond to every mail you write. I also made a video on YouTube and you can see the link for the videos in the description about the way we communicate with you or you can communicate with us. Frederik Sachse asked me to play a song with this instrument. <laughs> I'm sorry but that, you have to wait a while. It also has to dry overnight so uh, next week I will play a song on it when it's, uh, when it's still alive, when I'm doing the right thing here right now. So I will repair this instrument. Hopefully it, it, it stays. Let's get more, more glue to it. At this Na Verbol festival we performed in Belgium, it was absolutely not possible to use uh, our fire bagpipes because it's, it, it's very dry in Europe right now. We have, we, have, we have a great summer, which is good, but we, have, we haven't got enough rain, so um, the whole nature is so dry that um, we are not allowed to, uh, to use anything with fire uh, because it's, it's just too dangerous. That's a good reason not to use fire on stage. I think that's a good reason. Some people say that our instruments are having a rough time with rap hall. Uh, that's right. We see music instruments as uh, a tool to make music. For, <laughs> for us, the music is more important than the instruments we play on. And uh, we had some accidents with our uh, instrument lately. This instrument broke earlier. It's not easy to concentrate on this and talk with you, I must, I must only say. Stay. I got a Rapalje cup where I can put water in. And <laughs> what I'm using right now here, a t-shirt I was, was wearing at concerts. This is one of my shirts. Very thin linen um, because I was wearing it a lot, and I use old shirts for uh, things like this. I tend to reuse many things for other purposes. So first, I sweat in it at the concert. <laughs> I first washed it, then I uh, shred it to pieces, and I'm now using it to clean the instrument of excess glue. I know that I also really, 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 really need to look for a new musical instrument. Simona Baugarten writes, the poor instrument. Yeah, is it because we treated it uh, wrong in the first uh, place or now? <sighs> this repair. I promise you to, uh, to repair this while I'm talking with you. I need to let this dry overnight and I will make a video when I take those. In. Tanya Varenkotten writes me, I don't think 
it will hold. Sylvie writes, must be musical glue or magical glue. Hikina Boy writes me, nice thing for a show, seeing you tinkering with the broken Gituki. I hope this is not too boring for you to look at. Tania Coppini writes, what kind of glue is this? This is, uh, this is supposed to be a very good wooden glue, Bison. D4 is one of the best um, bonding um, thingies, numbers there is for glue. Donna Dillard writes me, time is special and the truth you being there means you hear us. You, you bring so much culture, like a time travel, thank you for that. Yeah, I'm here for you and I want to be here for you as much as possible. And that's the reason that I, uh, I really try to, um, to make more uh, Rapal shows this way. Just being there for you live, show you what we've seen in the weekends from all the concerts we did. And um, yeah, to give you some extra information about our travels, our music and everything we do. We do. Elena, ask me, hi. What has been the hardest thing to repair? These repairs are the, the, the hardest repairs there is because there's a lot of tension on these, from these strings on these instruments and I'm really not sure if it holds, but um, let's hope for the best. Jeroen van der Ham, success with the reparatie van de Gitoki. Thank you very much for that. Duizend Top said, don't touch it anymore now. I will not, I will leave it here and I say bye bye. So be easy and free.